This is Brad with uh, Floating Wing Farms. So, I haven't been doing a lot of FaceTime talking on these videos, and um, I'm just I'm just basically camera shy. I don't do a very good job explaining things. I get twisted up in my speaking because I'm not really used to talking to a camera lens, but. Um, I'd like to do more of it if you guys are interested in maybe uh, some DIY instruction or uh, if you just like to see more of you know me or Heather talking about what we're doing. Um, or if you'd like to know more about our farm, you'd like to see more of different things on our videos uh, if we're doing stuff you don't want to see let us know either way we'll be glad to accommodate we, we're just kind of trying this out for fun see see where it leads us um, we're just a small farm we don't do a whole lot of uh, gardening we want to do a lot more um, things are happening to where we can do a lot more farming uh, as far as gardening goes and um, we'll try to focus more on that in the next few weeks probably um, I've got to get my field ready it's kinda of overgrown right now there's not a whole lot I can do with it at this point but in the next few weeks I will be able to and we'll get the farm going so yeah if you'd like to see more of a certain thing or like I said some do-it-yourself instruction or whatever we've got some big projects coming up we've got a playhouse we're gonna build we're gonna build um, a duck coop and we're gonna build a pig enclosure for uh, Petunia who's currently in my living room right now but um, when she gets a little older she's gonna need a spot to go outside she needs to go outside more anyway we take her out three times a day we feed her three times a day we get her out and play with her and hold her she's getting more tame which is what we've been told to do is to get her out and hold her and just get her used to us before we um, before we just let her run roam around she's been pretty good she turns her water bowl over three times a day or more depending on how many times we fill it up but uh, no it's not it's not as bad as I would think having a pig in the house I know I say stuff about it a lot but it's really not that bad it's uh, kind of about the same as having a dog the dog probably being more friendly I would think uh, I would say a dog is way more friendly than a pig especially a pig that's not tame but she is doing a lot better she's a lot more tame uh, she's excited to see us when we come in from work and um, she's a lot of fun she's a lot of fun so I know you guys have been wanting to see the rest of the patio I haven't got it done yet hopefully completed this weekend which um, gotta go get a lot of materials but had two days of rain I kinda put a damper on it uh, the place in Gunnersville where I got the blocks shorted me 15 blocks and I didn't realize it till we already got them all down so I gotta go back to Gunnersville get the blocks Home Depot shorted me 10 bags of um, base material so I've gotta go get those and I've gotta get some more sand and some more um, pea gravel edges like where it goes around the patio 
we've got to get some of the joint sand to go into the joints so that whenever we um, so that whenever we sweep that into the joints it'll lock them all together but it's a work in progress uh, should be getting that done hopefully Friday evening and then uh, get you a video out so you can see that but no it's a good project it's a lot of work but it was a lot of fun doing it um, hope you enjoyed watching we did a lot of work on getting some tomatoes planted and I'll show you that later we did some work on the garden we got the other garden bed cleaned out and we planted some uh, or Heather planted some peppers and cucumbers and uh, some other stuff I forget what all we got we got a bunch of vegetables back there strawberries are doing good muscadines are doing good um, I gotta plant my blueberry plants that came in the mail the other day some blackberries the blackberries are doing great we're gonna have a good blackberry crop this year thanks everyone who's watched our videos we really appreciate it uh, got way more views than I ever thought we would and if there's like I said before if there's anything y'all want to see please let me know either in the comments down below or let me know by email or Facebook um, anything like that floatingwingfarms.com you can contact me there but um, yeah thank you for for all the views and if you want to see more just hit the subscribe button and the like button and that'll help our channel out a bunch so thank you Thank you.